Cocktail and Tiki Drink fans. This is Bourbonville with Bourbonville's Pirate Bar. Today we're going to take on one of the classic Tiki Drinks and I guarantee you won't get stung. But before we do that, hit, make sure you hit that subscribe, like, and hit that notify bell so you're the first to know when we upload new content to this channel. And while we're talking about it, if, if there are some drinks out there that you'd like to see, put them down in the comments. We'd love to hear from you. Alright, so let's talk about the Scorpion Cocktail. It was originally invented by the famous tiki drink the entrepreneur Trader Vicks back in the 1970s. But he actually designed it as a tiki drink that was served in a giant bowl, almost as big as those margaritas you, you get at some of the restaurants today. But the Scorpion Tiki Bowl is great for four to six people. But if you just want to enjoy it on your own, we're going to show you how to do that right now. We're going to start off with our Mixology and Craft Boston Shaker Set. We're going to add in just a little bit of ice because we're going to serve this over some crushed ice in just a little bit. Throw that right in the mix. And we're going to start off with something that you don't normally see in a tiki drink. Some could say this is the high class tiki drink. But we're going to actually uh, use something that is actually quite rare. Today we're, we're using um, Corsevere Cognac. So if you're not familiar with what cognac is, it's actually distilled wine, but it's still um, a liquor. Okay, and we're going to add in three quarters of an ounce of that. Put that right in the mix. And next, it calls for um, an ounce and a half of rum. Today we're using St. Pete's um, delicious spiced rum. And if you haven't tried this one, give it, a time. give it a try. It has a little bit of a bite to it, but it's an interesting, it's an interesting distill. Put in that ounce and a half. Next, we're going to add in two ounces of orange juice. Throw that in there. It's got a few moving parts, but it's, I, I assure you it's worth it. Now, here's something that's common in, in the tiki drink world, Orgiat Syrup. And you just, you have to kind of shop around because prices range all over the place. Okay, we just need just a little bit of that, just a half an ounce. Because a little bit goes a long way. And that's it. We take that, give that a good shake. Check out some of my other videos where I talk about why you shake some drinks and why you stir some. Set that aside. And we're going to get an appropriate piece of glassware for this drink. There we go. We don't have a bowl, but we have a bowl-like piece of glassware. All right, we're going to take our strainer and carefully pour that into the opening. And what a beautiful drink this is. Fill that right up to the top. This is popular all over the world. That's why we're serving it in a globe today. All right, we want to garnish that appropriately with a pineapple slice and the appropriate tiki umbrella and, of course, a straw. And there you have it. The scorpion in a bowl-shaped glass, not a scorpion bowl, but an individual drink. This is Bourbon Bill with Bourbon Bill's Pirate Bar. We hope you enjoyed the show today. I hope maybe you learned a couple of things along the way. If there's cocktails you'd like to see, be sure to put them down in the comments, and we'll see you next time. Cheers.